Welcome back to day eight of the triple silver cell operation. There's the current flow on the beast. Cell number two, 1.4 amps. Cell number one is 1.8 amps. And you can tell a big difference here in the amount of uh, impure silver that's being consumed in this anode basket in number one as compared to the anode basket in number two. Why is cell number one chewing through the silver quicker than cell number two? I'm not sure. There's some variable that's different between the two cells. First thing we wanna check is the amount of electrolyte we've got down in here. It looks like this one is okay. Let's check cell number two here. That looks okay as well. So we're good on electrolyte in both of the cells. That's the current flow on cell number one before we add some more impure silver into this uh, silver cell. Let's go ahead and pull this up out of here. You can see that anode bar is getting pretty close down into the electrolyte. I'm gonna add some impure silver shot. Yeah, that thing, this one's chewing through the silver much quicker than cell number two. And after we add the shot, there's the current flow. It jumped up a little bit. Let's take a look down inside cell number one. See how this thing is looking. That is gorgeous. Look at all that silver in there. Today is day eight, so we should have about 40 troy ounces of high purity silver in cell number one. Let's take a look at cell number two. There's our current flow, 1.4 amps. What we'll do is add a little bit more impure silver into the uh, anode basket. Put that back on. And there's our current flow after adding the impure silver shot. Let's get down in here and take a look at this thing. Silver cell number two. Let's see how this thing is looking. Oh yeah, we're doing good in here as well. Look at those chunks of silver down there. See that? Yeah, that's gorgeous. It's high purity elemental silver metal grown in my electrolytic silver cell. Look at that. Beautiful. Here's the current flow on the beast. 2.1 amps. Let's take a look down in here and see what we got going on. The uh, anode basket seems to be okay. Let's look inside the cell now. Oh yeah, look at that, man. This is day eight. So we should be looking at about 80 troy ounces down in this silver cell. Man, it's really starting to reach up and touch the anode filter. You see them trees right there? Look at that. This is just beautiful. I wish you could see it in person. It's very sparkly. Okay, I think the electrolyte level 
is okay in this one as well. There's the current flow after we checked the beast, two amps, and uh, we're getting pretty close to being complete with this refining. And we've only got about maybe a couple of uh, kilos of impure silver left in our uh, container here. I transfer it down into a, uh, a smaller container so it's easier to to handle. That's all we got left out of eight and a half kilos of uh, impure silver that we started with. I'm very pleased with how this is progressing. The uh, silver cells are performing beautifully. And so this will complete Silver cell maintenance on the triple silver cell refining for day eight. Thank you for watching.